What's up, what's up, what's up, YouTube, it's JP the Heals, okay, so I want to talk about a couple of stories that happened, okay, uh, one was my friends and I, we were at this, um, mini mall, and I had left, and when I left, um, they said that some guy drove by in a van, and he, he yelled out nigger to her, <coughs> and flipped him off or something, I'm not exactly sure if he flipped him off, and they kept on going. And I was laughing because um, uh, the same thing happened to another one of my friends. He's um, Egyptian, and we were in Kyoto, and got some some guy did that to him. I didn't. I was there with him, but I didn't notice it when he uh, when he said it, or he gave him the bird or something like that. I'm not sure which one. And so I was laughing and stuff, and I said, "Why didn't you guys just jump in your cars and follow them guys <coughs> to um, you know until they until they get to a light and then." You know, talk to them, see what they're, you know, why they did that. You know, because here in Japan, you can, um, you can talk to people, you know. And I said, they probably just joking or just came and come back from America because a lot of people go overseas and they get poisoned with that racist stuff and they bring it back here. And they, you know, they thinking it's funny and stuff, but what it is is they tend to forget that this country has so many different ways of, uh, how can I say, so many different ways of, discrimination you know and some people might call it racism but if they do have it it's it wouldn't necessarily be towards blacks like it is in the, um, America because it's just not that many of us here and plus um, it would be more or less a country thing you know so it would be if it were blacks it would be just black Americans or or black Cubans or black Europeans or you know, Africans or or Ethiopians or or um, whatever they're uh, Libyans or whatever you know. So, but you know, they bunch everyone up. You know, and it's just a guy gene thing, and it's um it's okay because they um because you know the cultures are really different and stuff. But there is this one African nation in um, this one nation in Africa where or African nation that uh, they speak Japanese. And everything is the same. It's just that the um, language is different. So anyway, um, my wife came home and told me that one of her um, that one of her uh, well, anyway, somebody that she knows said that they um, walked into the um, to that mini mall and saw us, but they didn't know who we were. And, he was, and the um, guy was with his friends, and he was like, "Oh, the girls, black guys over there. I want to go over there and you know kill them or something like that." And uh, she told me that, you know, she said she was, she, when a guy told her, well, then he, then she said, then he said he looked again and then noticed it was me, you know, so he, um, that I was with, um, I was there and then he had, um, and he started laughing, you know, cause, uh, and so my wife got angry and was like, you know, that's not funny. Why you want to say you want to kill somebody, you know, uh, cause of that color or whatever. And then she said, and then she told me that. She said, well, I know if he would have went over there and started messing with you guys, you guys would have hurt him and his friends. And I was laughing. I said, you know, if they don't, um, I told her, don't worry about that because a lot of people are always thinking like that. You know, they want to uh, hurt somebody. And it doesn't matter just black. I mean, you got over here, it's like white people and stuff, but they're not all just all white, you know. Um, you got the, the uh, people on the British island or... I guess they call it British Island. Uh, the, you know, all white people in Europe, they're not all friends, you know, in Japan. In Japan, They all isolate themselves in their own little groups. But sometimes you get a few that do hang out, but their history of their wars and stuff, you know, is still there, and, and there's still that pride, so you can't just say, I'm white, you know, unless, you know, a black person come on, and they might all team up together. But then again, you know, some people don't do that. Um, like I said, on one of my videos before, I was in uh, Nagoya, and it was this Israeli guy, and it's another Canadian guy, and both of them were Jewish. And uh, the guy said, "I'm, I'm Jewish," and the other guy said, "Well, I'm Jewish too." But the other guy knew the, can the uh, Israeli guy knew that the um, Canadian guy wasn't Israeli, so he said, "Well, I'm Israeli. You're not Israeli." Israeli, and I was like, <laughs> kind of shocked. Because I was like, okay, that's okay, fine, you know. Uh, you know, it's kind of shocking and stuff. But, you know, I told her, don't worry about it. I said, because kids, you know, people are always doing that because they don't have anything to do. 
and people are always challenging people, especially when they're bored and stuff like that, so I wouldn't even take it serious, and even if I would have heard them, I just would have laughed or, or like, all right, whatever, you know, <laughs> because uh, all that stuff is just um, way their form of entertaining, and because, of, you know, all these violent games we have and watching television and, you know, a lot of um, murder and stuff, you know, killings and stuff that's on TV, even in the um, car, uh, superhero um, movies and stuff, you know, kids grew up with that and the first thing they're going to see if they have some little inkling of negativity they're going to say you know the stuff they see on TV so I'm not really worried about it but I just thought I'd share that with you. Sit down. I'm out. Peace.